The Nerdy History of Plumbing, Episode 3, Copper Pipes. Copper was originally found in pipes dating back as far as 4,000 years ago in ancient Egypt. Egypt, meaning two lands, was made up of two kingdoms, one in the Delta region to the north and the other to the limestone-laden region to the south. In 3000 BC, Menes unified the lands and started a civilization that lasted 3,000 years. He did this by constructing large basins to contain flood water, then digging canals and irrigation ditches that helped the Egyptians control the Nile. Historians say that by 2500 BC, an extensive system of dikes and canals and sluice had been developed and remained in use until Roman occupation, circa 30 BC to 641 AD. While all of this water control was being put into place, the Egyptians started to create copper pipes. In the temple of King Shereya at Apsura, constructed around 2500 BC, archaeologists discovered benches in the walls and remnants of stone basins. These were furnished with metal fittings for use as laboratories. The outlet of the basin was closed with a lead stopper attached to a chain and a bronze ring. The basin emptied through a copper pipe to a trough below. The pipe was made of 1 16th beaten copper to a diameter just under two inches and a lap joint seam hammered it tight. This could be considered the first flushing toilet, but shows a level of construction and organization that up till now had never been seen before. Subscribe to learn more about plumbing's history, or if you have questions about your home's plumbing and need an expert, Call the plumbing nerds.